As kids, we learned what a number line is. Eventually, we also learned that there are negative numbers that go in the opposite direction of the line, and that the line can go further left or right, and even up and down. A French mathematician named René Descartes, however, decided to take it up a notch and publish the idea of the Cartesian Coordinate System. The Cartesian Coordinate System is a mathematical system that translates formulas in algebra into figures in geometry. Remember the perpendicular lines we had at the beginning of this video? The horizontal line is called the x-axis, while the vertical line is called y-axis. These two axes extend infinitely in all directions and intersect at the point called origin, which also serves as our starting point. Since every point on a number line represents a number, every point in this plane represents a set of numbers called coordinates. A coordinate is composed of two numbers separated by a comma and enclosed with a pair of parentheses. The first number is the x-coordinate or abscissa, and the second is the y-coordinate or simply ordinate. Coordinates help us locate a point on a plane. Let's take these coordinates for example and try to locate this point on the plane. Starting from the origin, we need to move one unit to the right for the x-coordinate and two units upward for the y-coordinate. Placing the point here, we now have the point with the coordinates 1, 2. If the coordinates are positive, it would mean we need to go right of the x-axis and go up on the y-axis. If the coordinates are negative, we need to go left for the x-axis and down for the y-axis. Now that's it for the basics of the Cartesian Coordinate System.